you guys welcome back to my vlog um, so this is going to be kind of a day in the life um, and pretty much getting Camden who is my firstborn boy uh, ready for kindergarten because he starts kindergarten um, actually he's there right now he's at school for his first day of kindergarten and I'm kind of doing this video or this whole vlog kind of backwards so I realized after I had filmed a bunch yesterday and then this morning of us getting ready for school that I never really got on here and like did any kind of intro or anything like that. So I figure I will just put all of this in the beginning of the video and then the rest of the video will, you'll see, it'll just be us prepping and getting ready for the first day. Um, and I'm going to go pick him up actually pretty soon. I just got ready, did my hair, did my makeup. Um, Quentin is napping and i'm trying to figure out like this new schedule now that camden is going to school for the day like he's in there for a full day too a lot of people have asked me if he's going for only half day or a full day and i guess around here they do full day for kindergartners so anyway i need to figure out like a new schedule now that cam's going to be in school um and hopefully i can get into like a really good routine i think i want to move quentin's nap up a little bit so usually he goes down close to one and i think i'm going to move it now to like um noon so that i have two full hours of time to get work done or like work out or just use those two hours just to get things done that i need to do even if it's like around the house or to run errands or whatever anyway i'm like rambling now but it was pretty emotional like last night i was feeling all sorts of different emotions just like thinking about dropping Camden off at school y'all know that he has never been to school he's never been to preschool he's never been to daycare like we didn't do any of that we have kept him home with us for five years so it was a big deal um and it's just like sending your little like baby cub out into the world it's just like really overwhelming so I've been feeling lots of anxiety um but also like excitement for him he's so excited it's he's literally been talking about this all summer. So I'm so stoked for him. I know he's gonna meet so many new friends. He's gonna love his teachers. He's gonna love school and learning, but it's just like, y'all know, you mamas know, it's just like a lot. It's a lot to take in and, you know, and deal with. Surprisingly, I did not cry this morning. Um, my girlfriend told me when she dropped her boys off for school, she was like bawling. And I did think that I was going to cry, honestly, but, I just didn't I feel like I feel confident I know that he's gonna just thrive and have the best time so I'm really really excited but it is bizarre and it's weird it feels like an emptiness almost him not being here um so yeah just been feeling all different sorts of crazy mom emotions but I know everything will be okay I'll get through it I'll get used to this new routine um, and I just cannot wait to pick him up and hear all about his day. Yeah, I just finished getting ready. Like I said, I wanted to share a couple products that I have been using recently that I have been absolutely loving. And I really wanted to share with y'all because I think you guys will love these products too. So, um, if you've ever heard of the brand Kish, they actually sell a lot of their products at Ulta. And that's where I first heard of them. I am obsessed with their satin line specifically. I've been using like all of their stuff. So this is actually one of their satin um like little scrunchies if you guys can see it it is a beautiful like leopard print but it's like a neutral leopard print which i really love um so i've been using this for my hair so much recently to throw it up in a bun or back in a pony or even do like this little half pony that i've been doing a lot um and then they also came out with the satin eye mask to sleep in if you use eye masks satin is amazing it's really great for your skin especially something around like something that you're going to put on your eyes and let it sit there on your face all night long like you want to make sure it's a really good material when you're sleeping on it it helps retain that moisture so y'all know that i love to put my moisturizers on my night creams my serums all of that um i pretty much like want my skin to be like greasy <laughs> before i go to bed and this helps to keep all of that moisture in and locked onto your skin it is so so like silky soft and just really nice and then a couple of their other products that i've been loving lately are their little microfiber scrunchies so it's like got like that towel material and again i got the leopard but they do have other prints 
And then I've got their blush and rose gold microfiber towel. So it's like one of those little hair towels that you twist your damp hair up in. And these are great because they protect against damage. They keep that moisture in your hair and keep it from dehydrating. If you get out of the shower, your hair is wet and you need to tie it up for a minute, do your makeup, get dressed, whatever you need to do. These are great because they are very highly absorbent. Um, but also they will protect your hair. They won't damage your hair. I have been loving the microfiber line as well. Kish has so many more products that y'all can check out. I will have a link down below in the description along with my coupon code Liza for 20% off. And thank you so much to Kish for sponsoring today's vlog. So I'm going to go ahead and eat something really quickly. I have to make a quick phone call and then I'm going to go pick Cam up and I will bring you guys along and we'll see how his day was. So excited. What you guys doing in here, huh? Hi, Bo. Bo's over for a little play date with Quentin. Um, Jen had an appointment to go to, so she dropped off Bo for a little bit. And Cam ran up to Lowe's with Alex, so they're not back yet. So the, the little ones are just playing right now. What you guys doing, huh? Bo, you're getting so big. You look like a big boy. You look like such a big boy with that haircut. A V card. Quentin, is it time for a haircut for you? Mm. What do you think? Should you get a haircut or do you want to leave your, your long locks? Look. You guys, I swear this playroom, it's like we clean it and literally no. the next day what? it's just What's a disaster that? and I cannot keep up. Cam is pretty good at helping me clean it up. Um, obviously Quentin does not clean yet, although he does like to vacuum downstairs, but I think it's time to, uh, to clean this up. Okay. I'm going to have a little lunch. I picked this up at Harris Teeter the other day. It is a chopped salad kit, Asian sesame. Looks pretty good. Um, so I'm going to try it out and let you guys know how it is. I think it should be pretty good for keto. Um, it just looks, looks like it has veggies in it, sesame bits, not sure what sesame bits are, some cashews and a sweet sesame dressing, so I might swap that out for something else because that probably has sugar. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try this out for lunch. I wish I had some protein. Like I wish I had some chicken or something to throw in here, but I don't. added a little bit of the sesame dressing even though there is sugar in it I only put a little bit I didn't even use like half of the pack but I looked at my fridge I literally don't have any other dressing than like creamy dressings like ranch and blue cheese which would be disgusting with a <laughs> Asian sesame salad so it's fine I'm just gonna use a little bit of the dressing mix it up and have this for lunch and uh, hopefully I won't have too many carbs later on in the day Sunshine in the day. I'm trying to make this darkness go away. I'll paint with colors and I'll sing until my lungs give out. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day. And I will leave my windows open so that I can hear the sound of. You guys, I'm helping Cam fill out his little board for the first day of kindergarten. And I was like, okay, I'm going to write 
your age in here. And I was like, this one, it says, I love. So think about something that you love um, and then think about what you want to be when you grow up. And he goes, I love you. Can we put you in there? <laughs> Honey, that was like the sweetest thing ever. I love you too. The money, the money kills me. <laughs> you are your father, honey. Hey, darling, can I tell you what's been on my mind? Sick and tired of the nine to five in the city light. Hey, darling, we could get out of town. See the beautiful world around, want to see it now. and get in that car Leave a little note and we'll drive real far Let's get out, we can leave this city Let's drive to the open air Yeah, the countryside is so pretty With the wind blowing in your hair We can look back someday Just say bye to Cam. Bye. Bye, Cam. He went to big boy school. Bye. I'm in the car line. I've been in the car line probably for 45 minutes. It's so crazy. So yeah, I've been in the car line for forever already, but I'm just so excited to see Cam and hear all about his day. I cannot wait to see him, you guys. Um, hopefully it's not going to be like this every time I pick him up, but I've never done a car line before ever. So I've heard stories about how you're, you're there for a while. I just need to figure out like, I guess when the best time to go is, but I mean, the students get out of school when they get out of school. So I feel like it's probably always going to be like this. So I like it. you liked school. Uh -huh. You had a good first day. Yeah. Did you, did you miss me? No. <laughs> you just liked being at school. Okay, you guys, look how cute this hummingbird feeder is. I'm going to try and take it over here because there's more light. But my girlfriend, Stephanie, the one who came to visit me last weekend to go to the Jason Aldean concert, she sent this to us as just like a little thank you for having her here, um, which obviously she didn't need to do. But this is the cutest thing ever. I love that it's kind of like a mason jar. Um, and there's like a little hummingbird on the glass right there. And I guess apparently she was having a conversation with Cam and was telling him about hummingbirds and hummingbird feeders. So yeah, I can't wait to hang this up and, um, see all the little hummingbirds come. I've got to like make the little sugar water concoction, but this is just so freaking cute. I love hummingbirds and they also remind me of my dad, um, because he loved watching hummingbirds. Oh, and also how cute is this? She sent a little hummingbird recipe to make the sugar water. <laughs> Stephanie is seriously the cutest. Okay, and then I also wanted to show y'all these shirts that just came in the mail. I actually was supposed to get them yesterday. I got them from Target. Um, please don't mind all of my clothes I have to fold. These are all clean. <laughs> and then I have Camden's clothes over there that I also need to fold. Um, but I'm about to get in the shower. 
anyway, so these came today, which was too late because I actually ordered this one. I wanted Cam to wear this for his first day of school. I thought it'd be cute with like his little khaki shorts and it has like little dinosaurs on it, but it came too late, but it's fine. You can still wear it. Um, I got size small cat and Jack. I'll link it down below, but I think it's adorable. It's like a denim uh, material. And then I just bought him a t-shirt. I like this one. Kind of like a blackish. Yeah, it's like a black with the white little I don't know, lines through it. This is also Cat and Jack, and I got him a small. It's only six bucks. Just like a little V-neck t-shirt. <laughs> Gonna let the sun shine in the day I'm trying to make this darkness go away